What's this? Okay. So this is, um, I think it's the TMF, but maybe it does a typo. It's the 8828. This is a multi-zone time of flight from AMS Osram. So it's a kind of a competitor to the VL53, um, whatever, XX series of uh, time of flight sensors from ST. Um, but I always like to see what the competition is doing, because I think like there's a lot of people doing time of flight stuff. Uh, so I made a breakout for this board. Um, this is the TCS uh, 34303, which is a, a CIE XYZ color sensor. And uh, somebody emailed this. I was like, that's kind of cool, because it's not RGB. It's um, CIE compatible. So it's like if you're using this with um, trying to calibrate a camera or a display, maybe you know, do you do unit conversion? What's this? This is a new chipset. So people are like, you know, you're familiar with the LoRa chipset. It's like the SX1282 or 83. I don't remember the, the part number we tend to use, but there's a new chip that's apparently more efficient and can go farther. The SX1262. So we made a breakout mm -hmm. uh, for this module. It's not completely pin compatible. What's this? This is a uh, IRDA codec chip, the TFBS4711, and I added on a IRDA transceiver, and I couldn't get this to work, actually. I'm still working on this. What is this? Um, this is the AS7343, which is an update to the AS7341, which is a popular 11-channel 11, 11 spectroscopy chip. This one does 14 channels. And More channels. last top secret, what's that? Uh, this is an ESP C6 Trinky. So now that we've got the ESP32 C6 Feather out, I thought it'd be cool to make a little board that just plugs into um, a USB uh, socket and can do like like little IoT projects for you. And it's like very compact. All right. That's this week's Top Secret. We got a bunch. Stay tuned to the blogs and social media. We publish these as we're working on them.